Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Ah, it's my channel, okay? It's still my channel. Um, Mama. I may not be posting on it, but it's mine. And Asante's. Yes. Uh oh. Uh oh. What for? There you go. So I'm obviously filming with Asante right here next to me. He's probably gonna give his two cents now and again. Um. Yeah, how you guys doing? How you guys doing? Tell me, how are you doing? Um, so I actually filmed a live YouTube video um, about an hour ago <laughs> and I deleted it but then I was like, Ugh, let me actually film and post, you know what, at some point I have to do it, okay? So I don't really have a plan for this video. Um, I don't really have a structure in mind, but I think it's going to be a, not even really uh, what's been going on in my life, because I'm not really interested in, in sharing that, but I did want to just come back on here just to say hi guys, and that I really, really miss YouTube, and I really miss the people on here. There were always regulars in my comment section and I miss those people. You know, YouTube has this um, vibe to it. People are just really, really kind and supportive on YouTube. Um, so today's the Monday uh, uh, of the long weekend for Easter. So I think it's called Family Day or something. Uh, but it's also my dad's birthday, my dad and my aunt. Um, my dad is my hero, guys. <laughs> I've been through everything with my dad. Well, not everything, everything, but we've been through a lot. And um, we've just gotten so strong and so close. And he's not around right now. But I think, um, you know, for me, when it's someone's birthday, it's when I really just pray and thank God for that person in my life. And I really just get to analyze the impact that that person has had in my life be it a friend be it a family member but um one thing i can definitely say about my dad is that he's been such a an impactful role he's played such an impactful role in my life um from when he came into my life um to now you know um a lot of my major life experiences had him involved and um yeah he's just been so supportive and and a message that i wrote to him was that like i've just learned so much about life about truth about <clears throat> about vulnerability you know and just just really about what life what it means to be an adult what it means to take ownership what it means to be the best that you can be and what it means to be a principled person. I've learned all of that from my dad and I'm not trying to put him on a pedestal or baby, baby. <laughs> and I'm not trying to like put him on a pedestal or anything like that, but then, I mean, it's his birthday, he deserves it. Um, so shout out to my dad. My aunt is like, um, <clears throat> kind of like our deputy mom like we go there a lot to her place well they come as well um we spend birthdays together and she and my dad share a birthday and she feeds us one thing about my aunt is that she will feed us well she's a chef so she cooks and stuff and um okay i just put on coco melon hopefully that distracts him so she's also growing older today. Two people that I really, really love. After Resurrection Sunday, yesterday was his pussy's birthday. Also love her, love her. I don't even know if she watches YouTube. But yeah, um, he heard me say the word birthday, now he's singing. One thing I'm gonna hope for is that I'm speaking louder than him, you know. <laughs> because I'm not gonna refilm this, I'm not. So, um, yeah, guys, I've been okay, you know. I think um, one of the things that was really haunting me when it came to YouTube, besides just me missing it, was that um, when I used to make videos consistently, I'd always say, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. And people would actually 
subscribe you know and now i've left all those people hanging with no explanation i've just ghosted the platform and um i mean i could justify it and explain why but i think it's also just rude so I, i've been feeling like i'm so rude you know um but also when i think of coming back i'll just feel like what would i what would i talk about what would i share i'm not the person i was before you know and um one of the one of the things that i've really been struggling with with rebuilding relationships right is that um i've, I've always like not always but i've I'm feeling like I'm having to reintroduce myself to people simply because um, I'm just not who I was before and I ghosted a lot of people for a long time. So now that I'm trying to repair some of those relationships, now that I'm making a video for YouTube, there's just like this pressure of having to explain that, hey, by the way. I'm not the way I was before. And I mean, obviously, it's implied. People are always growing, changing, developing. So I'm, this is not me saying I think people think um, I was always going to stay the same. But also, I think major changes have really, really reshaped me in major aspects, you know. So, yeah, whatever. Anyway, um, but I've been okay. I've been really, really okay. Um obviously i disappeared from the platform around the time of my pregnancy um that's when i like stopped posting i, w I think i posted a video or two but then you know <laughs> so um yeah i was pregnant had my baby it was a c-section um a, when he was uh almost a year old he had uh two surgeries a head reconstruction surgery and a brain surgery and then so that was uh, winter last year and then oh i shouldn't tell people your personal business yes okay sorry i won't talk about it now okay <laughs> so that happened and then um yeah and then i'm working i'm taking yeah. care of myself taking care of my baby yeah, and just trying to yeah, trying so hard actually yeah, to just um get back up and um this is not me saying that like you know oh my gosh it's been yeah. the most horrible experience what 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 yeah i i i, I didn't plan to have a baby <laughs> i didn't plan it um but i had to quickly get on board you know so i've been just trying to make the best of that situation um i think i'm a pretty decent mom i think i'm i'm, I'm a good mom you know yeah i think i'm a good mom um i could be better here or there obviously there's always room for improvement but i don't think i'm too bad i've seen worse so I think I'm a, I'm a good mom. Um, I think we have a good relationship. I'm really learning him. You know, I'm trying to be a really good daughter, to be a really good sister. And I'm trying to revive friendships that um, stuck it through because I lost a lot of people. I lost a lot of people. And I'm, I'm not blaming anybody, but then... Yeah, because I know that I ghosted everyone. <laughs> so I'm not blaming any, in anybody for that. Um, so life goes on. Life went on for a lot of people. And um, life is going on for me as well, you know. So um, one of the things that I remember when I was planning ahead for this year, I was just like just trying to access parts of me that I really enjoy, parts that, um, things that, things that make me feel whole, things that make, that excite me, YouTube really, really used to excite me, and so, I don't know, guys, if I'm coming back, coming back, but, um, I just wanted to come on here and say hi, I am okay, God has been so good, you know, if I were to talk about God, guys this video would be so long by the way sorry for the horrible uh quality 
I dropped my phone and drove over it. And then, so this one is my dad's spare phone. But it has also gone through a lot. So, but then I was like, if I don't film, then I'm never going to film. Because I don't even know when I'm going to get myself another phone. So. Um, anyway, God, guys, God has been my anchor. God has been my rock. Um, my siblings have been making life exciting. <laughs> And I, I guess I'm just growing in the role of being a mom. And like I was saying, like I just want to get better in all the roles that I play. Um, so there's nothing really much to this video, baby. Please stop now. No, mama. No, mama. No, mama. Okay. So, yeah, guys. So, I mean, if you have video ideas, questions, let me know in the comment section. I miss vlogging, but I'm not sure how I feel about vlogging now. Um, so, one of the things that I was struggling with with getting back to YouTube was, like I said, what would I post? And that's because, like, I just, uh, I, I, I wouldn't be able to share so much about myself and my life like I used to. Or maybe I would, maybe with time, maybe I would get, but, but then I've learned that, it's not necessary to get so in depth, you know. Um, I believe that yeah. I believe that sharing is yeah. is important, you know. Um, it's always intriguing to watch other people's lives and their life stories and to learn whatever you learn from it, be it for learning or for entertainment or whatever the case may be. But I I really don't know what what I would do if I were to get back on YouTube. Why? I don't really feel like vlogging. Yeah. I don't enjoy editing. Yeah. Even with this video, it's going to be a one take from beginning to end. I'm not cutting yeah. and pasting and I'm not doing any of that. And secondly, like um, some of the videos I used to make was like cooking videos. I don't enjoy cooking anymore. Um, my taste buds don't work like they used to. My senses don't work like they used to. So I don't smell things properly anymore. I don't taste well anymore. My eyes have gotten worse. So I don't enjoy cooking like I used to back then. Um, and I haven't gotten better at cooking. So I I don't I don't want to do cooking videos. Um, I I don't. I'm very. I don't know. I think I'm very guarded about my opinions of life in the sense that. I wouldn't be able to do sit downs and divulge in my thoughts or like divulge my thoughts about certain topics um, simply because I'm very protective also and um, I just don't want to I don't I don't want I don't want I don't know I don't want to be I don't know <laughs> I don't know how to explain it but I'm very protective of my thoughts and I just don't yeah, I don't want, I don't, I don't know, I don't know how to explain that point, but, um, I don't know how I would feel about doing sit downs and just talking about certain topics. I don't know how I would feel about that, hey? Um, so I don't know what I would come back and do on YouTube, quite frankly, you see. So, yeah, well, that's why I've been staying away. <laughs> I want to come back, but to come back and do what? And do what? And just blab on. I will. I will. So, you know, me, Konje, guys, it's just that kind of a situation. But, like, one thing about me, like, I'm entertaining, honey. One thing about me, I have a lot to say. <laughs> okay, now I'm going off on a tangent. Anyway, um, yeah, guys, I just wanted to, to be courteous enough just to come and say hi and just to greet. And um, it's very gloomy outside and we're about to go out now. Um, so I'm okay. I hope you have been okay. Um, let's chat in the comment section if you end up watching it this far. I'd really love that and um yeah keep well keep safe i love you so much um and i know that god has been taking care of you uh because i know he's been taking care of me and he's a faithful father 
um yeah